Wedding Nerdigans. This is the one and only Packer Girl 89 and today's Anime Nerdigan Live reaction video is going to be for Ninatsu no Tazai Revival of the Ten Commandments aka Season 2 Episode 3 titled Sacred Treasure Lost Fame. So last week's episode was just a giant clusterfuck. Oh my god it was all over the goddamn place. I'm really starting to get concerned for the series. I hope that um, I don't have to drop it like I dropped Ancient Magus Bride today. Um, but anyway, without further ado, let's get to the episode. So after the opening narration and stuff like that, when we did get to see Arthur again, which I love. Um, we start out on um, ad adapting chapter 113 of the manga. And I gotta say, the... Um, the world that Elizabeth is roaming on um, during this narration, it looks so beautiful. Oh my God, it looks gorgeous. I gotta mention this um, because this is just really making me realize something. I'm very curious what you guys think about this because recently in the manga, we found out that Esterosa has a connection to um, Elizabeth. And I'm starting to think that that in, in um in the imagination or like in the dream world that Elizabeth's in, I wonder if that's Esterosa. Like I'm starting to think that's Esterosa. Oh my god, that would make so much sense. But uh, sorry, I had to bring that up. Okay, I really, really gotta complain about this because it bothered me last week too. Diane's hair is not supposed to be. In pigtails! It's supposed to be down. And I'm really disappointed because I wanted to see her do the spinning with her hair down. It would look so much cooler. But um, seeing this gets me really hyped for um, another arc that's going to happen eventually, which is the um, the 3,000, or like, uh, oh yeah, the uh, um, the training arc that's going to happen in, uh, in the past. I can't wait for that arc. Anyway. Oh my god, anime, you're really stepping up this week. You're stepping up to get rid of the, uh, to make up for that clusterfuck of an episode last week. And I am loving it so far. Oh my god, Gather's counterattack. Oh my god, it's so pretty. Oh my god, I, okay, I know people were saying they can't stand Gather right now. But god, it, later in the manga, you will love Gather. <laughs> right now, Gather is being an asshole. Oh, this fight between Diana and Gowther is so perfect. Oh, my God. Now, this is the reason why I gave the anime a hard time last week. This is what I want from you, anime. Like, this is what I want. Not that clusterfuck of an episode you gave us last week. I, I don't like the... I don't like that people are defending it. I am sorry. I cannot defend that shitty episode from last week from a manga to anime adaptation standpoint. It was just a giant clusterfuck. I'm curious what you guys think of the wording here. Because in the in the anime, Gather says, before uh, lock me up before I lose myself. But in the manga, it says here, um, and this is on page uh, 16, he says, before I disappear. Like, I don't know how to think. I don't know which wording is better for this situation. But I kind of like the anime's wording a little bit more because it makes a little, it makes more sense to me anyway. This part was skipped. Uh, there was a, there's a whole heap of problems that need to be taking, uh, need to get taken care of before then, uh, was skipped. And now we're on page seven, uh, the five minute, 29 second mark. Oh my God. It's so gorgeous. Oh, Wow. I, uh, anime, this is what I know you can do. Just don't fucking do this clusterfuck again. Seriously. Okay, I gotta ask you this, writing. Why is there no, t why does Derriere's dialogue not have taking it from the ass? Okay, English dub, you better fix that shit. You better fix that shit. Because I I'm, I'm, don't like that, I, it, maybe it's just a bad translation, I don't know. But, God, I do not like that Darier does not say taking it from the ass. Because that is something she says constantly in the manga. Because, you know what Darier <laughs> Okay, there was some content skipped here that needs to be mentioned. Um, this was. Uh, what the hell is this giant hole? Or, hey, something's... Uh, ugh, let me start over. Hey, there's something weird over here, too. Um, 
what the hell is this giant hole? Uh, this was all skit. So after Esther Rosa wakes up, we are in chapter 114. Um, I don't know if we're going to get the first portion of, um, or the first half of the um, uh, first page or not, but we'll see in a second. This part was skipped. Uh, goats in a less gout, they're you, my memory uh, was skipped. Yes, the black was so perfect. So yeah, the first couple panels from um, uh, the first page of the chapter were definitely skipped. They were flat out. But um, let me get to where it was. Hold on a second. Um, here it is. Your Majesty, Your Majesty, Your Majesty, are you well? Uh, Slater, what happened to me? It seems someone unleashed a powerful ability that even rendered uh, many of the holy knights within the castle unconscious. But this power, could it be? That was skipped. Oh, no! <laughs> Look at that! Oh, it wasn't supposed to be sister! It was supposed to be my lady! Oh my god, now you're making it sound- Oh god, now it sounds like- Oh god, it sounds so wrong! <laughs> no! You're <laughs> No! Oh my god, Gather's top form is so cute! Oh my god, but this part was uh, skip dialogue wise. Gather shrink! No, it's more like, and then um, the dialogue was. Let me double check this real quick. This was skipped. Here we go. Take this while, the conduct, uh, while we conduct the mission our Lord has given us. My lady, what was that you just said? Yeah. Yes. Yes, yes, he could. We know who made Gouther. We know who made Gouther. The original Gouther made Gouther. <laughs> That's all I'm going to say. But we're going to, we'll find out. Uh, I don't know if we're, we're not going to get it to, we're not going to get to it this season. There's no way. Okay, the part that I thought was skipped was not skipped. They just changed the order of the scene, which is okay, I guess. Of course, Hog is better after he took a dump. The 11 and 16 second mark. Oh my god, because in the manga, Meliodas says, yep, but the face, instead of bingo, but the face looks so perfect. That facial expression is so perfect. It matches perfectly. Yeah, Meliodas, what are you, Gouther? Like, have some sensitivity, man. Have a little sensitivity. <laughs> it doesn't give a fuck. Well, he somewhat does, but he's just trying, Emiliotis is just trying to protect Elizabeth, because he knows what's coming. He knows what's coming. And I know what I'm excited for. I just want to get to Escanor. <laughs> I want to get to Escanor already. Really? Oh, that's not, this isn't fair. This part was skipped. Well, then I suppose I should take a look at, um, at how Camelot's doing. Hold on, but the, uh, the ball looks gorgeous. Oh my God, it looks so pretty. But it was skipped. It's not fair part of that checking up on Camelot was skipped. Oh my god, really? This is what it was supposed to be. Um, uh, knights and apprentices are to concentrate on evacuating, protecting the citizens. And as for the holy knights, those with large range powers are to uh, position themselves and surround uh, the target. Those with close range powers uh, will join me in the front lines. Um, here we go. But the flying pig <laughs> made this so anticlimactic. So now we should be going into chapter 115. And I got to say, this episode is a huge improvement. A, like a thousand times better than the shit we got last week. So thank you, anime, for getting your shit together. Oh my god, we got to talk about the Albion. The Albion looks amazing. The attack looks so fucking cool. Oh god, this is good. This is such a good episode. <laughs> Anime, can we keep the rest of the series like this, please? This part was skipped. We suddenly, um, we just suddenly dodged out of nowhere. Would you have preferred we not dodge? Well, not exactly. We just suit, um, destroyed the castle, uh, gates with just one attack. No, wait. Uh, this was skipped. It's probably gone now. No way. Uh, it was skipped. Scratch that last statement. It was there. But God, seeing this uh, goal, uh, seeing this Albion attack, it, 
the um, the barrier is just really cool. Uh, this part was good. Uh, we're not gonna make it. Everyone, protect King Arthur. Don't do it and run and save yourselves. Um, they are not going to make it. Uh, Merlin, and then. A bride, Meliodas! Oh my god! So this part was skipped. Um, a blast just like, rather, a couple times larger than the blast that giant released was shot right back at it. Um, was it a miracle, was this? Uh, was, uh, yeah, that's where we picked up, was, was it a miracle? Um, this part was skipped. Unbelievable! The legendary captain of the seven deadly sins? Uh, was skipped. This part was skipped. Sir Meliodas, we're coming with you! Uh, please tell us what to do! Um, and also, uh, Don't Fall Behind, uh, was Skip, but God, I love this music! This music is so fucking awesome, and this fight is just amazing, and Ar don't worry, Arthur will be okay, he'll be okay. This was skipped. Um, that is one solidly built toy, you're not hurt badly anywhere, are you? Uh, was skipped. Um, but the sword is definitely busted. This was skipped. It can't be! Yes, yes, Las Vegas back! Yeah! So now we're getting to um, chapter 116. And for the most part, chapter 115 was, was done pretty well. Yes, there was some skipped content, but it wasn't that bad. So now we're getting to the Sacred Treasure Lost Vein, which is actually the title of chapter 116. And let's see um, the kick assness of this sword. It looks by the way, it looks beautiful animated. I can't fucking wait to see Lost Vane in action. So let's get to it. Oh my god, Lost Vane in action. Oh my god, Lost Vane in action is so cool. Oh my freaking god. Oh, the full counter times five. Ooh. Wow, it looks better than I thought it was going to. Wow, anime, you really stepped up your game this week. Oh my god! Oh my god! This is just seeing this just gets me really hyped for um, Escanor versus Esterosa, and also when we get to it eventually, Escanor versus Meliodas. Ooh, I am so hyped from this. <sighs> this part of the dialogue was skipped. He he's um, just too much. He took that huge thing down all by himself. Uh, was skipped. Yeah! Man, the colors she's wearing are a lot different than I thought it was going to be, but she looks beautiful. But, um, I, I'll talk about the animation for the tree growing. Ooh, it looks gorgeous. Oh my god, the tree looks amazing. Way to be blood, Gerard. You know what? This really, <laughs> this really, I, it's kind of like, almost, is like the beginning of the end of Bond being useful, sadly. Because Bond, I swear, Bond is now, like, the Yamcha Sin. But we'll see what happens. Like, I'm going to talk about the, um, I'm, this is major spoilers if you're not caught up with the manga. We'll see what happens when Bond comes back from the demon, the realm of the Demon King, if he can prove himself useful. Oh, my God! Oh, I'm so hyped for next week! Because I think next week is, hold on, I just want to double check real quick. Oh man, next chapter is gonna, or, you know, next episode, the chapter, if we're adapting the chapters I think we're going to, holy shit, it's gonna be good. I am so hyped right now. This, and, this week, Natsu no Taza anime, you redeemed yourself. This was definitely even better, I would say this was better than the first episode that I covered, episode one. So, I'm very curious what you guys think. I'm really happy with the anime this week. The anime definitely stepped up its game. We don't, it doesn't feel like a clusterfuck anymore. We're going in the orders of the chapters now. And I'm really stoked for the rest of this season. I'm, if, anime, if you're going to keep, go, if you want to keep going in this direction, I am down with it. But I got to tell you, that full counter, oh my god. It's just, just seeing um, Meliodas fight like this, it just gives me so much hope and so much hype for Esterosa versus uh, Escanor, which I can't fucking wait for, because that fight is so goddamn epic. We just need to get to Escanor already. <laughs> but um, I would say the thing 
that, that the thing I'm concerned about with this series is I don't like how the writing is, is done for Derriere. I don't know if it's just my uh, just the sub the subtitles or slash the translation, or if it's um. Or if that is the correct translation. If if it is, I hope the English dub fixes it because it it doesn't feel like Derriere unless she says you know take it at the ass like or straight from the ass. Like I was hoping we were gonna get that, but we might not, and that really makes me sad. Anyway, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. What did you guys think of this episode? Um, do you, are you guys really hyped up? Especially mon manga fans, I gotta ask you this. Are you guys really hyped up for Esterosa versus Escanor, which is gonna come? And, um, what did you think of, uh, the animation quality this week? It was definitely a whole lot better this week. Anyway, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdigan Zinc. If you love what I'm doing and want to contribute to my channel expansion, there's a few ways you could do that. You could donate to my PayPal, Patreon, purchase something off my Amazon wishlist. All that's in the description box below. Also, make sure you follow me on Twitter, Twitch, Facebook, brand me on PlayStation Network. All that's in the description box below as well. Until next time, Nerdigans, I'll be seeing you later. Bye.